An explosion at a power plant near Franklin this morning left one person dead. A new boiler at Oak Grove power plant exploded while being installed. This is the second major incident at this facility this year. Back in February, four workers were rushed to the hospital after being exposed to a possible hazardous chemical. News 3's Connor Bean was in Franklin today and has more details. A scary situation for a tight knit community. I was shocked, a little scared, but I immediately prayed for anybody that was involved. A boiler explosion at Oak Grove Power Plant left people near Franklin feeling uneasy. It's a little bit unsettling when it does hit that close. Robertson County Emergency Management says one person is dead and two more were injured in the blast. It's the second time in six months that an accident at the plant has sent people to the hospital. Richard Strange and his colleagues were exposed to hazardous chemicals at the plant in February. We wanted to bring awareness to the fact that this incident happened back in February, and we did not want something like the incident that happened today to actually happen. Strange is now being represented by Sean Fox, who says the company needs to be held accountable. He called both incidents strangely similar. There are mechanisms in place, safety mechanisms in place, where uh, this shouldn't happen. For now, Robertson County residents are praying for those affected by today's tragedy. Pray for all the families involved. They will need it. God is busy right now. In Franklin, Connor Bean, News 3. We reached out to Luminant, the company that owns the power plant. In a statement to KBTX, they thanked first responders. They also told us they will continue to work with regulars while the cause of the incident is investigated.